I have already taped off my skin, applied my base coat, and this white polish to my nails. You're going to want a cup of room temperature tap or filtered water. Make sure that you tape off your skin just so when you dip your fingers into the polish, it doesn't make a mess and it makes the cleanup way easier. The colors that I will be using are Essie Playdate, Julep Maven Bunny, and Essie Cute as a Button. It always helps to know what order you want your colors to go into as you place them into your water. And once you figure that out, you're just going to go ahead and one color at a time start dropping your colors into the water. The more drops you do of each color, the darker the color is once it gets placed onto your fingernail. And you're just going to keep repeating these steps in whatever pattern you'd like until you get a big enough bullseye to be able to draw a design into your water. If you're having a hard time with it spreading, just go ahead and give your cup a little bit of a shake and those colors should spread right out for you. Next you're going to want a toothpick or a needle or something pointy and you're just going to start drawing right into your nail polish and make whatever design you'd like. Here I'm going for kind of a flower design. So I'm starting from either side and pulling right into the middle. And then I'm going to go in again in between those little petals and make even more petals. And when I push down in the middle, I'm just pulling that design closer in and making it smaller. I'm going to go ahead and take my pointer and my middle finger, pick where I want, and I'm just going to drop my fingers right in. You want to hold it there for a second and blow in the water to dry that polish on the top. Then you're going to go ahead and take your Q-tip and you're going to go ahead and take off that polish around the top of the water. And be careful not to pull your fingers out of the water too soon because if you do, you're going to get that extra polish on your nail and mess it all up. Now you just want to follow the previous steps for the rest of your fingers. Keep building that bullseye with all those colors. And then go ahead and start drawing the same design. Again, dipping your fingers in where you'd like the design to be on your fingers, blowing on the water to dry the polish on the top, and cleaning it off with a Q-tip. Pulling your fingers out of the water slowly also will help minimize the amount of air bubbles on your nail design. The reason that I painted my nails white, by the way, is because white was the lightest color that I used. And here I'm just going to show you a little clip of how I clean up around my nails. Now remember, I taped off my skin so it makes cleaning way, way easier. I am using 100% acetone, by the way. I'm now taking Big Matte Top Coat by Sally Hansen and this top coat is just going to remove all of the shine from my nail. Because these are such light pastel colors, I thought it would be great to use a matte top coat and that's just me showing you what base coat I used. And I'm sorry about being out of focus. I was going to remove this clip, but I thought it would just give you a general idea. I'm sure everybody knows how to put a top coat on their nails though. But this is how I do my water model design. Thank you everybody for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, comment, subscribe. Let me know how you think this video went and enjoy your day.